Hey friends, it's Kelly and welcome back to Mama Needs a Goal. Thank you so much for joining me today. If you're new here, welcome. So friends, if you've been following me um, with the last couple of videos, you know I have made some carrot pretzels. I have made some um, butterscotch peanut butter bird nest cookies and some butter, or uh, not butterscotch, peanut butter and chocolate bird nest cookies. And I off camera went ahead and dipped some um, peeps and some chocolate and a couple extra chocolate covered pretzels. So today I'm going to go ahead and put together a Easter treat tray and I thought I would bring you along and just show you how I'm going to lay the tray out and to show you how I'm going to incorporate all those goodies that I made in the last couple videos. So before we get started, I'll quickly go over the ingredients that I'm using. So I have here just a plate of some chocolate covered pretzels. I dip some in green and some in orange and then I just have some um, sprinkles on them. And then as I mentioned, this is the carrot and you'll get a good close up of these. These are the carrot pretzel sticks that I made. And then let me reach and grab the other stuff. Oh my goodness. Oh, here we go. And there are the bird's nests that I made. I have two trays of those. I have a lot of stuff here, friends. So I got stuff everywhere. And then I went ahead and took a whole bunch of peeps and just dipped them in some of the white chocolate. And I thought they turned out really cute. Put some sprinkles on there. And then I have a bunch of candy. I have some Hershey eggs. And then I have some milk chocolate Hershey eggs. I have some pastel M&M's and some pastel M&M, peanut M&M's. I have some Reese cups I'm going to throw on there. I have some York peppermint patties. And of course, you know, I really enjoy sour candy and I thought these were cute. They're called um, Sour Bite Gummy Bunnies. Is it called Trolley? They have little buddy heads. So I picked up a pack of those. And then of course, what tray isn't complete without some jelly beans. I just bought the um, Brock speckled jelly beans just because I liked the color of those. So I got quite a bit here. I'm not sure if everything will fit on my tray, but we're gonna go ahead and try to do our best to get everything we can on here. I do have a, and I'll, I'll turn the camera down and show you, I got a big white tray and a couple of those ramekin dishes. And then I have, let me show you real quickly. Oh my goodness, I have this cute little bunny dish. Is this adorable? This reminds me of like grandma. Um, I know Bill's aunt used to have these um, and I, I know it brings back a lot of memories. And I thought, you know what, that would be cute, the little candy dish on the tray. So I'm gonna try to incorporate that as well, we'll see. So, oh. Yeah, just break it, right? Um, let me go ahead and turn the camera down and let's put this tray together quickly. So let's get started. So here's my tray. I have these little, ram I think they're called ramekin, I'm pretty sure, uh, dishes. And I'm thinking we'll put in like the little gummies and stuff like that. But I wanna get them laid out first. I have four of them. And I do think that I'm going to use all four and I think I'm just going to basically kind of kind of cut a corner like that. And then I think I'm going to do the bunny in the middle like that. I think so. I am going to remove this lid so I do not end up breaking it. Because you know how I am in the kitchen, folks. So now I think what I'm going to do is start with my bird's nest that I have here. And I really like how the two work together, the dark and the light. So we're going to go ahead and just put those on there. Like that. 
Now I did have these in the refrigerator, friends, because it being chocolate and butterscotch, they do melt. Um, so I wanted to make sure we didn't have melted nest everywhere. Okay. Let me get my other tray. Hoping you guys can see what I'm doing. I'm just going to fill in like the center and bring it out, I think, right here. to just make it there we go it looks lovely all right now I got a chocolate on my hands so let me wash my hands real quick all right so since this is kind of all some chocolate and peanut butter I think I'm gonna put some M&Ms the peanut butter M&Ms right in the cup right there I'm gonna go ahead and put some peanut butter M&Ms. That looks pretty, pretty pretty. All right, now, do we wanna do, what do I wanna do? What do I wanna do? Hmm, I think we're gonna do is maybe pretzel sticks down on this corner and kinda of come in. So let's start with these. And pray I don't drop this tray plate because you all know. Put that down. There we go. All right, and we have our little carrots. So we're just going to put oops, these on here. Oh my goodness. There we go. Just, you know, I think. May need to. I'll have to see if we need to if we put that back in or not. May not be. May not be able to put that back in. We'll have to see. All right. You know what? Why don't we do this? Okay. I think I got a plan here. And friends, I don't always have a plan starting out. Um, I think so when I think I do, sometimes it changes. So, we'll do the, that, and what we can do is take this over there a little bit like that. There we go. All right. that right back there like that. I think that will work. There we go. That right there. All right. Let's see if I can give you a quick little spin. See how we're working now. There we go. I'm liking that. Liking it. Liking it. Liking it. All right. Now, what do we want to do? Have some bunny peeps here and some chicks actually. And what I said mentioned before is I just took some peeps, dipped them in chocolate, and added a little bit of sprinkles. So why don't we?
go. Just like that, my friends. Just like that. Then we come back in and add a couple more bunny rabbits. Put one right there like that. Use up the last of these bunnies. All right. Turn it around for you. Is that adorable or what? All right, so I do have, let's see, I want to open up the ones that are loose and put those in the jars. I'm going to put these down here. Oh, get those broken ones out. Regular M&M's. Just lost my shoe while I'm walking. <laughs> All right. We will put these up here. Put those up here. How beautiful. I love these colors. Love, love, love. And then put some of these sour candies in here. Gotta have sour candy. It's just not Easter without sour candy. <laughs> Look at that, friends. How stinking cute. How cute, how cute, how cute. And then... I'm eating sour candy. I'm going to go ahead and put some of the speckled jelly beans right in the middle. Put them on there. Like that. All right. And then, what I'm going to do is just take some of the other candies and just strategically place them in there. I don't know. I don't know, I like that. Let's do that. Let's do some around the edges. You color coordinate and just put them around the edges, kind of do like that. Let's find a pink one. I think a little bit of color coordinating. Like that. I don't have another yellow. Really? Really, really? Like, why? Why, why, why? <laughs> there we go. I'm going to do a couple. Let me do this. Two green and a pink. And all the way down there. Mm, I guess it doesn't matter. I'm going to do two pink and a green down here. How about we do two pink? Yeah, am I overthinking this? <laughs> uh, sometimes I think I do. But there we go. Will anybody even notice it? I don't know. So put those there. I have some Hershey little candies. You know what? I'm just going to sprinkle those on the tray. like that. Just like that. And this may be a little overkill. Let me see eggs, yeah. 
I think it's a little overkill with the Reese eggs, so I'm going to hold off with those and not put those on the tray. So I'm hoping you guys can see all that. Let me take the camera down and give you a close up. All right, my friends, so here it is. Oh, it turned out so cute. I'll just give you a quick overview of what it looks like. How stinking adorable. Lots going on here. Lots for different people. A little bit of everything. There's a little bit of everything for everybody. And then like I said in the middle here is the jelly beans. <laughs> I think I overfilled it. <laughs> but there you have it friends. Didn't that turn out cute? A great little holiday treat tray. Simple, easy to put together. And like I said, it's something for everyone. So there you have it. All right, my friends, so that'll do it for today. I really hope you enjoyed coming along with me while I put together this little sweet Easter treat tray. If there is anything you have questions about, just go ahead and leave a question in the comment section below. I will gladly answer anything that I can. And also, if you guys have like treats that you have made in the past that has been a big hit, Leave those in the comment section as well because I would love to try out some new recipes. I'm always looking for some new ideas. So friends, thanks so much for joining me. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please consider subscribing because it does greatly help me out. It allows me to continue to put these videos together and share with you. As you know, I love, love doing this. And please hit the like button as well if you liked this video. And also, 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 I'm asking a lot of you guys today, um, if you haven't already checked me out over on Facebook and Instagram and Twitter and Pinterest, please consider checking me out over on those social media sites as well. I am very active over there and I post a ton of different things, just everyday life in the brown house. So I would appreciate it if you would check me out over there as well. So friends, thanks so much for joining me and I will catch up with you next time. Bye.